of the town after their dramatic Brownlow tie. Capping it all off, a special flight from Canberra as James' proud mum jumped at the chance to hug her son. Mark Doran with the first of our reports. Life's tough at the top and it doesn't get any higher than this. The Brownlow boys at the traditional Carbine Club lunch where the kings of industry toasted the knights of Aussie rules. You haven't taken your makeup make off? Yeah, there's a, a bit of a scar there and uh, who knows how that got there. But, uh... <laughs> it was a predictably slow start to the day for James Hurd, long-time idol and former teammate Tim Watson joining the brilliant bomber for yet another drink. It's been going since 6.30, it hasn't stopped. Uh, I think it'll keep going for a little while longer yet too. Already one of the game's glamour boys, football's highest individual honour will be the key to even greater riches. Essendon, Jay Hurd, three marks. But not even the Brownlow could get Hurd into a city nightclub early this morning. The bragging they knocked back Paul Kelly last year. Uh, yeah. So that's, that's the end. Yeah. With the same composure and class that's made him such a valuable force on the field, Hurd simply played on. The real partying was over by then anyway. The superstar knocked off his feet by the enormity of it all. <laughs> Essendon's second last draft choice in 1990 worked harder than anyone when given his chance. Many at Essendon calling him the next Neil Danaher. I think James Hurd probably is Kieran Perkins of Australian football. Appearances at Essendon social functions brought the house down. Look, thank you very much for just giving me that reception. I'm a bit uh, out of words at the moment. So. We love you. Thank you very much. But James wasn't really speechless then. The man of the moment caught out in a major way during what he thought was just another interview at the Channel 7 studios today. Uh, yes. Come in. How you doing? Oh. Hi. How are you? How are you? Good. <laughs> you heard you come down? Playing. Oh, did you? Oh, good. Yes. Uh, Channel 7 brought me down specially. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Good to see you. Yeah, it's good. Oh, it was just so exciting. It it's really very was. Exciting, yeah. I just sort of didn't think he was going to get there. He kept telling me he wasn't going to win it. So don't worry, Mum, I'm not going to win it. Mum finally taking award winning son home for some much.